Hi, I'm Erin and this is Our Craft Table. And today I am sharing another haul with you, this time from Walmart. So I'm doing a grand total of four hauls um, because I went to four different stores over the past week and a half, two weeks, getting different things on clearance and picking up things for my planner. So right now, um, this is the Walmart haul. This is all Christmas clearance items, I believe. Yep, everything except for one thing is a Christmas clearance item. So that's why I'm kind of surrounded right now, because I have so much kind of big, bulky stuff. And let me tell you, the biggest, bulkiest thing is something that I'm not even going to try to bother to put on camera right now. It's um, a four-foot tree that I got that is white, and I've always wanted a white Christmas tree. And now I have one. And it was originally $25, and it was marked down 50%, so that was $12.50. So I was so excited to get that. Um, there were only maybe three or four of them left. They had quite a few of the regular green four foot trees available for $25 at marked off 50% um, on their clearance. So um, I didn't worry about getting any of those because I already have a couple of artificial trees, one really tiny one and one big one. Um, but the white one is one that I've always wanted because I want to put a white tree in my kitchen next year. I wanted to put a white tree in my kitchen this year but I had so much other stuff going on with Christmas and all the decorating and everything else I never really got around to looking for a white tree and if I had realized that they had a perfect small tree for $25 at Walmart I probably would have gotten it a long time ago. But I think it all worked out for the best because now I have it, but I got it for 50% off. So that's still in the box. I'm not going to bother taking it out of the box until next year when I decorate again. But I will tell you that if they go on sale any deeper than 50% discount, like if they get down to 70% off, I'm definitely going to pick up a couple more. I think I might pick up a couple of the green ones just so I can have two little Christmas trees on either side of my um, my front door. Um, I'm not sure. If I do that, I'll definitely let you know. But right now, I'm just happy to have the white one, so that's good. Something else you might have noticed is that the decor has changed up a little bit behind me. I actually really love this, and I wish I did this a long time ago. I feel like this looks way better than the background that I had the whole month of December. Um, these little, you can't even really see those from here, these little boxwoods came from Target. So you can look at the Target haul that I did. But this part, these lights are so pretty and I kind of feel like they could even be left up all year. But I put them up now because I thought, well these will look really cute for the background of the videos but also for New Year's Eve. And I just really like the way that they turned out. Um, so these were on clearance too. I want to say they were $1.34. I really don't think they were more than $1.50 each. Um, they have 100 bulbs on them. And they're indoor-outdoor. Um, so I got one package of multicolor. And this is the color that I use on my window um, that has the candy cane um, the candy cane window treatment. So I got one pack of um, multicolor on clearance. So now I have two packs. And I got one pack of red. I would have gotten more red if um, they had any more, but I, I searched and searched and I didn't see any more. So I got a pack of red. But I'm going to keep looking because you never know. It might be there and I just didn't see it. Um, and... I got five packs of the white, and that's what's behind me. So that one's empty, but four of the packs are what I used behind me. So I think it looks really nice and full, and it's nice and bright. 
um, because sometimes, well actually every time that I've done a video it's been at night. I want to be able to start getting to do videos during the day, but I feel like this is a nice, you know, nice pretty lighting for the nighttime. So I like that I got these. I'm very happy with that, especially for less than two dollars each. And the boxes, I realized, are really good sized boxes, because obviously I'm not going to be able to get these back into the box. That'll never happen. But these will be really good for, you know, wrapping presents for birthdays, or even if I want to just, you know, hang on to them until Christmas and wrap Christmas presents in the next year, I can do that. But these are nice sizes. Um, you know, you can always recycle them in any other type of way. But I'm definitely going to hold on to the boxes. So I have to figure out where I'm going to put those. I think I have to get another Christmas storage bin after all of the... Um, clearance shopping that I did at Walmart. I didn't get to do a lot of clearance shopping at the other stores. At um, Target they didn't really have too much. At Michael's they didn't really have a whole lot either. And um, at Dollar Tree they had pretty much the same ornaments and things like that that I had already gotten during the regular season. So I didn't get too much there either. Um, but I was very happy with the things that I was able to get at Walmart. Um, so I will keep going because the other things that I was able to get were these poinsettias. And I love the way the real ones look, but we can't have real ones because they're poisonous for dogs and cats, and we have cats. So I'm definitely not going to take that chance because um, our cats love to nibble on plants and I definitely don't want them to nibble on a real poinsettia. But these were $5 each. Actually, I think they were $4.94 each. Yeah. And they were 50% off. Um, so I got one with just the regular matte velvet leaves. And then the other one, that's a combination of the matte velvet and some glittery leaves. So I thought these were really, really pretty. I really like the way these look. So I'm gonna put these away probably until around Thanksgiving time next year and bring them back out. But I think they're really nice. Um, I think that there were a couple more left. There were a couple more left, I think. Um, so if they go on discount any deeper than 50%, I might pick up another one or two. Um, just because I really, really like these and I've never had these live in my house. So I'd like to, you know, get some fake ones since the fake ones are so pretty. But if not, I'm happy with these two. And I mean, for $2.50 each, that's not bad. So, you see these mugs here? These are so cute. And I saw these mugs um, the last time that I went shopping for Christmas presents, which I think was the day before Christmas Eve. I think it was on December 23rd. And I saw these and I thought, these are so cute, but I'm going to wait and see if they go on clearance because I don't need them now. I got a whole bunch of um, Christmas mugs from Dollar Tree, so we didn't have any use for these. But, you know, I said I was definitely going to pick them up if they went on clearance. And they did. And I was so happy because there was one, no, there were two of these left. But these were the only ones left that they had in stock that I knew of. So I grabbed these and I got one of these two. Um, and I just thought these were so cute. They were 50% off. And... I am really sorry, but I don't see the price on here right now. But, whatever it was, it was a really good value. I hope it doesn't matter too much that I'm not telling you the price. Um, but this is just adorable. The owl with the little hat on, with the little pom-pom down at the bottom. How cute is that? It's so freaking adorable. And then, um, well, I'll go to this next one. That's This was the same price as that one. I, unfortunately, I don't know what that price was, but let me see, does this one have a price on it? No. But so cute. The little snowman with the little twig arm and the mitten and the little hat. 
and he's just so cute with his little rosy cheeks. I just love this one. And this one unfortunately has a little chip right there, and I don't, I don't think that that's that big of a deal. Um, and maybe I should have said something. I could have gotten a little bit more off now that I think about it. But I can just, I can fill this in. That's really not a big deal. It's really cute. I like it just the way it is. It's perfectly fine by me. This one I love because it looks like a sweater. I love that pattern. And it's huge. I mean, this, <laughs> that is a huge mug. And this compared to this, look at that. That's pretty good. And it's so cute. Eat, drink, and be merry. How adorable. And then finally, another huge one. So cute. And then reminiscent of this owl. So they kind of coordinate. And I mean, that is adorable. Another huge capacity mug. So, so pretty with the snowflakes and the little owl. And I just, oh, I love these. They're so cute. So we're not going to use these now because, you know, we only really have a few more weeks to maybe a month of the winter stuff that we're going to keep out in the house. So I'm just going to pack these away very carefully and I don't really have anywhere that I can put these that they're out of the way so maybe I'll just kind of put them up here. Um, and then just pack these away and then bring them out next year right after Thanksgiving and that'll be, that'll be that. So something else that I um, saw at Walmart that I thought was so cute was this fleece blanket. And this is something that I also saw when I was shopping on the 23rd and it was five dollars and I almost bought it right then but I thought no this is definitely going to go on clearance. I'll wait until after Christmas to see if I can pick it up. And it did, and I remember this was five dollars, and so it was marked down fifty percent. So it was only two fifty. This throw is fifty inches by sixty inches, so that's a really good size. And I think it'll look nice, you know, draped along the sofa, you know, when we want to snuggle up and watch a movie or something on TV with our hot cocoa, and we have our little coordinating blankets. So you know, I had to get two. I wish they had another one, um, you know, so so Koi, True, and I could each have our own, but really what's the likelihood of all three of us snuggling up together on the, <laughs> on the sofa watching a Christmas movie at the same time anyway, but you know, I think three might have been too much anyway, but I just thought these were super cute. I had to get two of these, so $2.50 each, $5 for the two, I think it's going to look really nice is draped over the sofa in the winter next year. Maybe I'll be able to find another one. There were only two that I um, was able to find this time. So I don't know if they have any more in stock and they just didn't have them out or maybe I might see them at another Walmart if I happen to go in, uh, into another one. But I might pick up another one or two of these. But for right now, two is good. So I'm really happy. That's not bad. A fleece blanket for $2.50. Not bad at all. So... Let's get into the really cute stuff. So these were $2, but on a 50% discount, these were a dollar. I love these, these little wooden ornaments with um, words written on the stocking. So cute. I love these little birds. How pretty are these birds? So again, $2 marked off 50%. These are also very cute. Two dollars, little hearts with little words on them. Let's see. Cheer, wish, believe, Mary. That's so cute. More little stockings. Again, just for a dollar since they were marked off for 50%. Adorable. And keeping along that blue theme, I got these little blue ornaments. Um, these were $3.48, so they were marked off 50%. And um, 
I just thought these are so cute. So what is that? $1.75? I don't know. I can't add right now. <laughs> three fifty divided by two. That's a dollar seventy five. Yeah, it doesn't matter. So anyway. <laughs> So, um, but I actually got these because there was a craft that I had in mind that I wanted to do this year and I did not get a chance to do it. And does that ever happen to you guys when you have these big plans of all the things that you want to do and you just don't have the time to do them? So I got these because I want to make sure that I have the time and the materials to do it next year. So. Okay, and I'm back, and as you can probably tell, <laughs> it is a couple of days later. Um, <laughs> I ran out of room on my SD card to finish filming what I was filming for this haul, and I intended to get back to it later that day, and that never happened, so here we are. So, different hairstyle, different clothes, different... Uh, tablecloth. Well, it's not a tablecloth. Before, I was using um, the craft paper that I got from the Dollar Tree, which is an excellent value because you get a whole bunch of craft paper. I don't know what the footage is. I'll take a look next time I get it. But you get a whole bunch of craft paper, and it's been perfect to cover up and protect this table when we're doing crafts and, you know, when we're doing hauls and stuff like that. So I'm definitely going to get some more tomorrow. I thought that I had enough, but um, I was looking for the roll. I have like that much left on my roll. I couldn't tell because it was all rolled up. So I couldn't use that. So um, I definitely have to get more because I love that stuff. It is awesome. But since we're back, no time has passed for you guys, luckily, <laughs> just for me. So I'm trying to catch up and remember what it was that I was talking about the last time that um, we were here. But I know that we hauled uh, several different things. Um, I want to get back to these mugs because I now know what the price is. <laughs> so these little ones, when they were 50% off, were $1.06 each awesome deal and they're so freaking cute I love them so much so I think really really good deal for a dollar six and these that are larger were 198 when they were half off so I love these jumbo mugs too I love the different patterns and um, oh also Koi gave me some very good constructive criticism saying that the camera was too far away so hopefully this camera angle is working better too because I want you guys to be able to really see what I'm showing in the hall so sorry about that see this is why Koi is my editor he he does a good job he knows what he's doing so uh, yeah so now hopefully you can really see the detail of the things that I'm showing you so let me move these out of the way and get back to the other things that I got um, so I got some snowflake ornaments. These were $2.98, so that basically goes down to $1.50. These are sort of a silverish gold. They're like, almost like a tarnished silver color. I just, I really like them with all the glitter and everything else. I think these are really pretty. I got some gold stockings. I just love this little filigree type pattern. And these are also $3 normally, and they were $1.50. And then I saw these, and I thought these were so super cute. Look at that, the little zebra print, and the little fur up here, and I just, ah, oh, they're so adorable. I think these were $3, the tag fell off. Let me see if I can find it on my receipt. Oh, they were, um, they were also $1.98, so these were a dollar when I got them for 50% off. And then these, I thought were really cute, but I didn't get them for Christmas, I actually got these for True's Room. So these little chandelier ornaments. I love them because they're black, 
and sparkly and then they have the little dangling pendants on them. They actually remind me of something that was at my grandma's house. Her chandelier was white. Um, well, the one that was going up to the, the staircase, that was white. The one in the dining room was all crystal, but this just reminds me of that and I feel like it's just really cute and girly. So I got two for her to hang on either side of her vanity mirror. Um, we haven't set up her vanity yet. That's something that I plan on doing this month. So I thought these would be so cute, just like as little accents on either side. So I got those. So these are not going into storage. Um, these were $1.94, so basically a dollar each at 50% off. The final thing that I got on that trip were these little hedgehog ornaments. How cute! There's three hedgehogs in here. We only have two. But I just think that they are so adorable. So very cute. And these were $4.98, so half off. They were $2.50. And I can't wait to put these up next year. I wish I had seen these this year um, before, before Christmas actually was over. Is this, this is just adorable. I love anything that kind of represents the pets that we have in our house. So these are cute. Oh, and I just noticed that their noses are hearts. How cute is that? So I'm excited to put these up next year. So since it's been a couple of days since I actually went to Walmart, I had to go back again. And this time I went to um, a different Walmart that is still in my area but not one that I go to frequently. Um, actually, I think it's, gosh, it's probably been a couple of months since I've been to that Walmart. And I'm so glad that I went because I found all these things that I have never found at the usual Walmart that I go to. So it was definitely a really good trip. So I got another mug. I didn't see this at, um, at the Walmart that I usually go to. So Santa, he was a dollar six. Cause he's another one of the small ones, and I just love him with the little candy cane and the presents, and he's just so cute. I love the way the the um, the top of the hat goes down here to make a handle, similar to what's going on with the owl here. Just very very cute. I found more lights. This time I found blue lights and I was looking for other solid colors when I was at the Walmart I usually go to and they only had like I said one um, one set of the red mini lights and then they had a whole bunch of multicolored mini lights and they had a whole bunch of white which is why I have the white back here but I'm glad that I have the blue ones because I'm thinking about using these for when we start the patriotic holidays I'm thinking about maybe I don't know, doing something with the red, white, and blue lights. If not, then these are still lights that I'll be able to use in my decor come Christmas time. But I was just really happy to finally find a color other than multicolor. Something that I was super excited about because again, we did not have these at the Walmart I go to were these plates. How adorable is this? Each plate that I'm going to show has a different pattern. So this one is the one with the snowman and the penguin. And you know what? I, one of them has the price on it. It was something really cheap. I want to say this was a dollar. I also like that the person at this Walmart wrapped everything pretty nicely. So I didn't have to worry about chipping these plates or anything. I have a whole bunch of bags now, but that's okay. <laughs> Santa Claus. And my favorite little guy, the owl. These are going to be so cute for entertaining when Christmas comes around again. So another thing I was excited about finding at this Walmart was washi tape. 
I was looking everywhere at the Walmart that I usually go to for washi tape because they had so much during Halloween. I just knew that they were going to have some for Christmas, but they didn't. And luckily, when I went to this other Walmart, I had the mother load. <laughs> so much washi. I could not believe it. All of these are different patterns. I'm not going to bore you with all the different patterns, but I mean, look at this, 13 different patterns, and these were originally 98 cents, so they were 50 cents. Um, they're each five yards, I believe, so that's, that's a really good deal for 50 cents. So I got one of every single pattern. I sat there at the little bin that they had all the washi tape in and went through, and I was so excited as I kept finding new ones like oh there's one oh there's one so <laughs> that definitely taught me a lesson that I need to keep in mind that every store is different every store stocks different things and I was you know driving myself crazy trying to find washi tape for Christmas at Walmart and all I had to do was go to a different Walmart that was not that far away so next year I'll know and maybe it was a good thing that I didn't because they had so many things there that weren't at the Walmart that I usually go to. I think I would have spent a lot more before Christmas instead of waiting to stock up on things after Christmas. Um, so that's that. And then, I think that's all I got from there. Um, oh wait, what's this one? Because there's more. There is more. Okay. Okay, yes. So, um, I found more stocking ornaments. I like these white ones to go with the gold ones that I showed earlier. I got this book for True. And I actually keep forgetting to give this to her. That's why it's still in the bag. It's funny, I sometimes do that. I buy books and I forget to show her. Um, you know, but I know that she'll like, and this is a little baby book, yes, Pinkalicious is definitely way below her reading level, but Pinkalicious, the regular book, is one that she learned how to read um, years ago by herself, and she still loves reading the Pinkalicious and Goldalicious, and I think the other one is Silverlicious. She loves those books. So when I saw this holiday one, I was like, I have to get this for her, so I'm going to I'm going to show her later since I totally forgot to give it to her. Um, I think she'll like it. So it was $4.74. So, you know, that went down to $2.50 or less because this was also 50% off. I was really surprised by that. But it was so cute. And on the back, oh my gosh, this is dangerous. They show all the different um, Pinkalicious books that are available. I might have to get her some of these for her birthday because. Like I said, even though it's way, way, way below her reading level, what does it say, ages four to eight? Yeah, <laughs> that's not her reading level. It's just, it holds a sentimental value for her, and you know, she'll just read it, or she'll ask me to read it to her if she's not feeling good or something. It's, it's really cute, so. Pinkalicious and the Snow Globe. So we'll have to look through this together later. I think it has stickers or something in it. What are these? Are these little stickers that you can use? So, um, anyway, super cute. Spending too much time on that, I know, but I just, you know, really like that. I found these adorable little stickers. And these were actually with the baked goods, so for a second I thought they were, um, you know, the little things that you can put on cakes and stuff like that, but nope, they're just stickers. And. I want to say that these were a dollar. I'm almost positive that these were a dollar because they started out as two dollars. So I love these. Can't wait to use these. I love the little little Santa hats and I love that um, some of the little tassels are white and some of the tassels have the little um, you know sparkly bead on them. That's so cute. And this little snowflake set. So, That'll be cute on the table next year. 
half off for that too, so it was this one, $2.52, so half off of that, so it was basically $1.25. This is just kind of random, but I got some of that, um, that tape, that little tape that is double-sided. Uh, so, let's see how that works. And then I got a letter for my sister, because her first name starts with A. And then, where's the other one? And then a letter for my other sister, because her first name starts with M. And these were 98 cents, so basically these were 50 cents each. I thought those would be really cute um, when I give them gifts next year. I can put that on the tag. Unfortunately, they didn't have my brother's initial, and they didn't have my initial or Koi's or True's, but at least they had my sister's, so I thought that was good. And here's some little penguins. These were half off, so these were a dollar. I just, I love the little tiny ornaments. I like those on the little trees, like I mentioned earlier. Um, I got a four foot tree, and I like little ornaments on little trees like that. So I have a lot for next year. And so that is it for that store. So yesterday, I went back to Walmart. I promise this is almost done. <laughs> but yesterday I went back to Walmart and they put their um, their fall stuff back out in the clearance area. So I got this nice tablecloth. I really like this. It says that it's nine dollars. It was eight four wait eleven eighty four marked down to nine, but then it was half off again. So this was four dollars and fifty cents, and that was just. A really really nice pattern I really like this I think this will look very nice for Thanksgiving and then um, I got some Thanksgiving napkins these were 50 cents each they were each a dollar 97 but they were marked down to 50 cents each And then, the only thing that they had left for Christmas that I really wanted were these stockings. So these were 98 cents each, but then they were marked down 75%, so they were 25 cents each. So I got eight of these stockings for 50 cents. So I'm thinking about doing like a garland with little stockings hanging down. I just thought that would be really cute. And then, finally, oh, forgot about these. I got some more little pom-poms because um, these were all white and there's a project, a snowman project that I'm going to do with True where I need some white pom-poms. I think we used all the pom-poms that we got from the Dollar Tree. Um, and I don't think they have just like red, white, and green ones anymore. I think they have all these other multicolors, so I figured I'd get these. And surprisingly, these were 50, no, these were 75% off too, which is weird because this is definitely not just for Christmas. So this was like, I think they were 25 cents if I remember correctly. Maybe 50, but I think they were 25. And so then I got these lights. So I got these replacement bulbs, and we don't have bulbs like these anywhere, but I remembered that I saw um, a craft on Pinterest with these types of bulbs. So I got four red and four blue of these bulbs. And I mean, I love these. They're so old fashioned. I remember back when I was a kid when we had bulbs like these and these just really take me back. <laughs> But again, they're not for actually lighting up. These are for a craft project that I intend to do during Christmas time that I've seen floating around Pinterest for a while, but I could never do them because I didn't have the bulbs and I wasn't gonna go buy a string of lights for that. But this was a really good deal because these were a dollar each and they were marked down to 25 cents each. So basically I paid $2 for all of these bulbs. So, 
that's going to be a good amount of bulbs to be able to do the little project that I want to do. So finally, that's it. That's the end of the haul. <laughs> All this Christmas stuff is finally done. Um, I got a lot of really good stuff. Um, I didn't get stuff that I didn't need, so that was good. I got a lot of stuff that, um, you know, I can just basically stock up for cheap, and then that way I have even more to add to my collection for this year coming up. So I'm really excited about that. I love a bargain, so, you know, um, I'm pretty happy about this. So now I just have to inventory all this stuff, pack it away, and then we'll be good to go until it's time to decorate for Christmas. I think I saw something on Facebook that was already counting down the days to Christmas. And I love Christmas so much, but I'm sorry, I can't count down the days to Christmas right now. <laughs> Let me get past the other holidays and at least get to Halloween before I start thinking about Christmas. So that's it for this haul. Thank you so much for sticking in there and, and taking a look at everything that I got. I really appreciate that um, you guys are watching and I'll see you in the next video. Hey, bye.